We're love sending you. prayers and kisses yeah. to you, love you baby. Know. Okay. You're welcome. Bye, yeah. baby. Get some rest. She looks exhausted. She, she is. is. Like, it's serious. Because, yeah. you know, since my mom passed in July, I'm sorry. So seeing her is so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. I just want to. This looks oh. serious. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. We need to say a prayer for her, though, too, for real. So I don't know, do you feel, let's say one just together. One request, please, Lord, just make sure she's okay. Whatever she needs, whatever touch to bring her back strong, beautiful, smart, and powerful as ever. In Jesus' name, amen. Golly, that hurt my heart. Like, we argue, we're fussing, and we're fighting about stupid shit, and this is real stuff exactly. in the hospital. And I don't even know what happened with us last and night. I don't, but I, don't fine. Know. I don't know what happened. I don't just, Not I'm maybe sorry. Too slow. <laughs> I don't know, but it's just so. <laughs> no, it is. Marlo is like Jekyll and Hyde. Normally, I don't negotiate with terrorists, but I got my cousin in them on speed dial. I'm good to go. I don't know, maybe you were in your moment, but girl, you were like this close from hitting me with that. Oh, you know what? We went through the door. The door is so heavy. I don't know she if the very heavy. The yes. door slammed oh. on its yes. own. Yes. Are you serious? Wow. Yes. She thought you slammed the door on her. The door is oh, heavy it and it slammed, it slammed by yes. itself. Did you slam the door on money at her? I did not. I was drinking. I don't remember them bamming on the door. I don't remember slamming the door. But I do remember, and Sheree co-signed, that door was heavy as hell. OK, so that's it. Got wow. Hello. My name is Kels. I'll be your nurse for today. Oh, look, she got the goodie bag. I'm glad we're here because yeah. you missed it in Birmingham. Oh, uh -huh. We went to lunch, and I just remember the little phone call we had about Marlo attacking you. Oh, girl. Y'all look so cute last night. Y'all look happy. You see, Marlo go off on me. She gave a whole different story. No, so let me get to this. You know, you told me after it was all over with, she had a problem with you for mm -hmm. not being hard enough on candy. Yeah, everybody was leaving. I went outside, said goodbye. I go back in the venue, and she literally is like on attack mode. Like, I'm not doing that tonight. I'm not, okay. Don't make my fight hey. your fight. Oh, no, I'm not. not I'm gonna ask you a question. Like, you went too easy on candy because you didn't use the word. I am from Chicago. We don't use that word. Shooting? Yeah. I was there two days before the shooting, so I was concerned, truly, because I had 30 so why of did my you say shooting, though. And why is that any, any of your business anyway? Yeah, no. I don't do well with people standing in my face, coming in my personal space, and being aggressive, especially for Me no too. reason. She said she was sitting down. She said you were over her. No, I was standing against the wall. She was sitting, and then she stood up. Did she tell you that part? No. OK, of course not. She went on to tell me something happened with her nephew. I didn't understand if she was saying that her nephew was shot at the restaurant. Yeah, like, I wasn't clear. Her nephew worked for Candy's restaurant. He met a guy that was working in Candy's restaurant as well. They became roommates, and the one guy shot her, killed her uh, nephew. OK, that don't have anything to do with Candy. 